today's project, silt fence. So here at Bagot Point Seafood, I'm not exactly working on a uh, investor level budget. So today I'm at my lot here uh, to install some silt fence. And I'm about to get laughed at by every construction worker on all of TikTok because I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, although that's never stopped me before. I always say where there's a will, there's a way, and if somebody else can do it, there's no reason I can't learn and figure it out. So I'm gonna pound these stakes to span an area where I need to dig a trench, and pound them into the ground. And then I'm gonna stretch this rope, crab pie rope, across them, and then paint a line on the ground following the rope. So when I get to digging the trench, I don't end up with a squiggly trench and I'm not wasting material. Um, I don't know if this is how you're supposed to do it, but uh, that's what I'm gonna try. If your sledgehammer ain't covered in crab pot paint, ain't no crab. Well, now that I've overcomplicated that, I have to now do what I've arguably been doing most of my life, which is digging myself holes that I hope I don't regret later. About a quarter of the way done. Despite my best efforts, it's about as straight as Elton John, so. Up for discussion. It's a little uh, rinse and repeat at this point. Part of being a small business owner, in my position at least, is uh, if there's a trench that needs to be dug, uh, you're the guy to dig it. By you, I mean, I'm the guy to dig it. Probably could have just rented a ditch witch, but I'm a glutton for punishment. Well, staying true to who I am, I forgot measuring tape and all the zip ties and hog rings to hold this fence to the post. So I guess that means you guys are getting part two.